Well, yo, what's up, guys? I'm back again on another video. I don't share with you guys out the door. Uh, I do my clay ball step. I'll share with you guys a wax that I prefer to use. I'll show you how I do. Now, if I do my clay bar step, just spraying on my detail spray and stuff, clean. Okay. It's clay. Using the mother's clay. I'll show you guys the wax I prefer to use and why. After I do my clean and stuff. And this is a must here. The clay bar. See? It's got some contaminants here. Okay, hit that again with some detail spray. Always take your clay and lines. Never put it in circles. Might be something that brace it where you put swirls in your paint. I'm going to show you guys what a product I prefer to use after every clay. And why. All right, all right. Yeah, that's clay good enough. Ain't too many contaminants there. Okay. Let's wipe that away. Because it's been clay a couple months back. I'm going to show you guys the products I prefer to use. After every clay. That's all dried off. Now, I'll show you guys the product I prefer to use after every clay job. It's the Meguiar's Ultimate Paste Wax. That's the product I prefer to use right here. Now, why? Because this wax here will give me a good three to five months of protection. Basically, this wax acts as a sealant. That's why I prefer to use it. So if I ain't got time to really wax my truck within the next two or three months because I'm dealing with other cars or trucks or SUVs or whatever I'm working with, this wax here will hold me until I be, get back to it. I'm able to get the time and the chance to get back to this truck, see? So after every clay, this is the wax that I use right here, and this is the synthetic, hydrophobic synthetic technology. It's pure synthetic plumbers, hydrophobic technology in this wax. So it bees water like crazy. This is the main wax that I use after every clay. And I just told you guys why. This wax lasts anywhere from three to five months. And most cases, I better get back to it between that, that time, you know. But but have if I don't, because I'm playing around with so many other cars, y'all know how I do. I might be playing around with a Honda Civic or something, you know. So if I don't really get time to get back to this one like that, I still have that protection there, see. That protection will still be there. Even when I ain't messing with it. You know. So you got to pick a good quality wax out of your clay, man. Doing all that clan and using that low budget wax up there, man. It's really a waste of time, you know. You want to use some good stuff on your car if you want to clay it. Clay it and put some of the best wax up there. Not that low budget stuff that lasts you about 
two, three weeks and it's gone. Then you clay and then stuff starts sticking to it. Now, after you use this, you could take um, a sealant and come back over top of this. It's your choice, you know. You can come back over with a paint sealant. Maguire's fast finish. Anything to help prolong the wax. So the best thing to do, you probably could use the Maguire's Ultimate Fast Finish on top of this. They even make this wax last even longer. You get a year or two of protection out of it then. But this is mainly the one that I, I always use this particular wax right here after every clay bar. I use this one because it's very hydrophobic and I'm going to get the long term protection out of it. Be water like crazy. Ain't too many paste waxes out there better than this one. I'll tell you guys that right now. Okay? Ain't too many paste waxes out there can touch this one. All right, I just had to throw that out there. So I can teach you guys a little stuff. Uh, let's give you guys the tricks of the trades of what I use now, you know. I mean, you guys might have another favorite wax. Everybody got that, you know, favoritism of stuff they like to use. Just sharing some of the stuff I use, how I do my cars. Now I let it sit a while, then I buff it back off like this. Here. Just like this, like so. Like so. And see, you're going to get that long-term protection, see. Especially you come back over with fast finish. That'll seal it in. They probably carry around through the winter time, you know. As you know, it ain't long before winter come. It's already about August. See, then September, October, it'll be cold in the next month or so. Start getting chilly here around about the latter part of September, so you ain't got up about a month, month and a half. It's still getting kind of chilly here, especially at nighttime. Start getting in them 50s and stuff. So, um, I'll better get back to cleaning this one. But in case I don't, I have the best protection up here. See, it's been clayed and everything. Y'all saw that it's been clayed. I clayed back there. And my other one, another video you guys going to see. The best way to clay your ride. Okay. So I just want to share this one with you guys, man. The product that I use after every clay is this. Pick it up. It doesn't matter you're using a mother's clay bar kit. That doesn't matter. Clay is clay. Ain't no certain clay. Like I said, clay is clay. You know, no matter if you use a Maguire's, Mother's, Magic Clay, Griot's, Adam's, it doesn't matter about the clay, guys. Clay is clay. All you want to do is get the contaminants off the car, no matter what kind of clay you're using. Uh, you can use Mother's Synthetic Wax if you want to, to come behind it. That's your choice, but I, I, I feel more protected with this one. It's one of my favorite waxes in the world right here. The Meguiar's Ultimate Pace Wax. It's one I love to use, man. And I just want to share that with you guys, man. It's the best way to um, protect your paint when you're using a wax like that. And um, after you use your clay, that's the best way to do it, man. Silky smooth, very protected. You ain't got nothing to worry about now. You good for, for a whole lot of months. All right. I just want to share that with you guys, man. Good for a lot of months. And I just use this kit. Most I'm going to order the Meguiar's kit also. Try that one out. But um, I just use this because, like I said, it doesn't make that much difference about the clay you're using. You know, like I said, clay. Clay is clay. All you use the clay for is take the contaminants off, off the paint. 
Only thing is detailer spray used for lubricant. So ain't no certain detail spray either. You can use soap and water. Yo, I do the job. Alright, so guys, take care, man. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with your family and friends. And I'll tell them about how to do it, man. Tell them watch me. And um, that's how I share my tips. Take care. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.